With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, so the question is if the straight line represented by x cos alpha plus y sin alpha is equals to p intersect the circle x square plus y square is equals to a square at point a and b. Then show that the equation of circle with AB as a diameter is x square plus y square minus a square minus 2p x cos alpha plus y sin alpha minus p equals to 0. So let's see the solution here. So simply what is given in the question? We have given the two equation. One is a equation of a straight line that is x cos of alpha plus y sin of alpha is equals to p. And the second equation is equation of circle that is x square plus y square is equals to a square. Both are intersecting to each other. So we have to show that the ab is a diameter of the circle and this equation. So what we will do as we know if a straight line and a circle will intersect each other. So in that case the equation of that circle is given by x square plus y square minus of a square minus of lambda times of uh, x cos of alpha plus y sin of alpha minus of p is equals to 0 ok where lambda is what that is scalar. Now from here if you will try to write the center of the circle so what we can write down that that is the center of the circle it is nothing but is equals to minus of lambda cos of alpha divided by 2 if you see here this is cos alpha minus of lambda ok and similarly the center uh, uh, and the second point of the center of the circle will be that is this is x coordinate y coordinate will be minus of lambda into sin of alpha divided by 2 ok. Now we know according to diameter property according to diameter property we know that x cos of alpha plus y sin of alpha is equals to p ok y sin of alpha minus p this should be equals to 0 so as this is nothing but the equation of diameter ok so this center should satisfy this equation so in the place of x and y we will put these uh, values so what it will become that is cos of alpha in bracket minus of lambda times of cos of alpha divided by 2 ok plus sin of alpha in bracket in the place of y we will say minus of lambda sin of alpha divided by 2 ok minus of t this should be equals to what 0 so on multiplying we get minus of lambda divided by 2 into cos square of alpha minus of lambda by 2 sin square of alpha minus t is equals to 0 now if you take p to that side so what we get p will be equals to minus lambda by 2 taken as a constant and here it will remain cos square of alpha plus sin square of alpha. Now according to property sin square theta plus cos theta is equals to 1. So this term going to be equals to 1. So what we get we get the value of p is equals to minus of lambda by 2. This implies the value of lambda will be equals to minus of twice of p. Okay. So we simply substitute in this equation the value of lambda so what we get we get the equation of the circle that is x square plus y square minus of a square minus of lambda times of okay what we have okay sorry do one correction uh, this is plus okay this is what plus so plus minus it will become minus here okay now we substitute the value of lambda that is twice of p in bracket x cos of alpha plus y sin of alpha minus p it is equals to 0. Now see here this is what we have to prove and hence proved. So this is the required solution. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download doubt and app today.